Right now, 17 million Yemenis, more than half of the population, don't have enough access to food. This is because of a nine-year civil war that has resulted in one of the world's worst humanitarian crises. The war has completely upended everyday life. The economy has collapsed, and blockades at ports and major roads have disrupted food and aid supply chains. The current war is the culmination of grievances from past conflicts, with communities across the country bearing the generational wounds of the past. The war also involves other major regional and international players. Earlier this year, Saudi and Houthi officials held peace talks. However, Yemeni civil society groups criticized these talks as dangerously exclusive for leaving out civilians, who have been bearing the brunt of the war. In addition to facing extreme levels of hunger and poverty, there have been grave human rights violations, which have fallen especially hard on women, children, and religious and racial minorities. To break the cycle of violence in Yemen, victims and survivors must be at the heart of all peace processes. They must be consulted and supported in their demands for justice, which have been long subverted by political elites. Civil society and victims associations in Yemen are carving out hope for justice through coalition building, advocacy, and dialogue. Among these efforts is the Yemen Declaration for Justice and Reconciliation. It has already received the endorsement of organizations from all over Yemen. The international community must center victims' voices to ensure an inclusive, sustainable, and just peace in Yemen. Otherwise, the cycle of violence will continue.